Hey guys, I'm still Comment Lurker and we're still playing as Ray Magini. Let's see, today we want to go down and run out of precognition that I shouldn't have set up in the first place. Uh, one thing I do want to show off is a glitch right here. You see there are two water vines on top of each other. I had to run around to find one like this. They're not so uncommon. So, I know it shouldn't have taken too long, and it didn't. Uh, one thing about when there's a water vine on top of another water vine is, you get to harvest both of them. I was lucky that I actually succeeded both times. Sometimes you can fail one time and succeed another time. But, whatever, that's somewhat abusable. I don't think I've seen it ever happen here, though, because Joppa is a preset place. Probably, it's never going to have that happen. Uh, we did finish that quest, yes, right? Yeah, we finished it. Just wanted to make sure. Okay. Did you restock? Yes, you did. Tam Dromad Merchant has restocked. Okay. So, we want to talk to you and see what you have. Ho oh, hum. Terrible stuff. Nothing useful at all. Looks like two grenades. Things that aren't useful, and more things that aren't useful. The regenerator auto injector seems pretty nice, and the guns I can break down for bits, and the carbide short sword would be good if it was not a short sword. But besides that, everything is fantastic or terrible. I don't, I don't know. Oh well, doesn't particularly matter. Let's turn the auto gets off. And drop some of this stuff. We don't need that. I don't even know why I bothered to bring the uh, Gershling corpse. Drop this stuff. Oh, wait a second. He had a, he had a uh, glow sphere. Let's buy it. And let's also get some water. So, let's see, we want to make this an even deal. Right now I can show you guys, he'll offer us uh, 39 drams, but if we add a vine wafer to the deal, he'll uh, offer us 39 drams. So let's just get all of these, and all this, and I guess we can get that, but then we'd also, it would go down by two. Let's, for the sake of showing things off, let's not do that. So let's try it again. He's still offering us 39 drams. Try it again. He offers us 38 drams. So let's not go for that one dram worth of a single lead slug thingamajig. Uh, sometimes it says 23.03 or whatever, the, whatever it will be, point something. That looks like the same number, but it's a little bit higher. It just, by a small enough incrementation, that it's not, it doesn't show up. Like 0 0.021 or 0 0.025. And so long as that makes it enough to be big enough, he's going to take a whole dram away. So it's always good to go for, um, try, to try it with the same value as the uh, behind the decimal and going for a little bit lower and seeing if the higher one costs that extra dram. In this case, we don't have to worry about it because it goes up from 0.02 to 0.04, and we're 0.03. But enough wasting time on that. Let's move on and do things that are interesting. So, we got some stuff. We're going to equip that. Don't have to worry about torches anymore. The glow series you hold aren't so uh, fantastic compared to the floating ones, and they're not much better than the, uh... Hold on a second. I should carry this around. That's a good amount. It's too little, and, uh, they're not too much. Probably 25 is too much, but better too much than too little. Uh, what the hell was I talking about? I was talking about fish. No, no, no. I was talking about glow spheres. Uh, glow spheres aren't much better than torches, because... Torches tend to last long enough, doesn't particularly matter that they can run out. It's just obnoxious to have to replace them every once in a while. So, I like low spheres for that. Now, I actually do want to try something out. 
a little curious. Uh, let's see if we can. Uh, I guess I'll have to try it out over here. Probably should have tried to harvest. Probably could have failed to harvest anything useful. Actually, yeah, next screen. Screen. Let's. Uh, wait, wait for nine turns. Oh, both of these have two water vines. This one has one. So let's just wait a bit and wait a bit more and wait a bit more. And we got tons of water vine. Make up for all the water vine we didn't get last time. Walk, 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 and down. And hooray! There's already a 50, uh, no, I don't want to walk down something. There's already a 50, what is it, centimeter, kilometer, fetometer, what is this, what is this, feto, I mean. Wire strand, 50 inches. Yep, because in the future, people use the, uh, weird inch system, the metric system. This must be post-apocalyptic United States. So, just pick up some random garbage. Kill a random garbage. Enemies. Sturdy. Pick up some sellables. Cell fodder. May as well get some more of this. Witchwood bark. Gonna need it in the future. These G's. Some before. They are goat. Goats. Goat. That is a goat. They are goats. Not anything dangerous. Because they're neutral. I mean, yeah, if you attack them, they're dangerous. Uh, however, later on, they are goat folk, which are very annoying. They both look like G's, but they are certainly not to be confused between with did stuff. I don't know. Uh, it looks like daggers always are good to, uh, get, because they weigh so little. And, what do we get? We got five hit points. I should have used that trick, but I didn't think of it, so. Uh, let's see, let's get that. And once we get in there, I want to try something. Let's not let something get rusted. Ooh, we got a couple of things from that guy. Okay. Now that we're here, let's kill all these enemies so they don't get in my way while I'm trying to test something. And... There. Let's get this... Glow Sphere, take it off. We did get a couple, uh, few things that I want to check on. They're probably all worthless. Yep, that's what I thought. Generally, it's one weight, and it is a weird artifact. It's going to be a uh, grenade, which is why I always, get the, I always get the call correct on those. And if they're a tube, they're probably... Some worthless injector, especially if you've already discovered all the useful ones, it's probably gonna be a worthless one. Uh, so we took that off. Let's use lays and use it effectively to get rid of these guys. It's like, that, that would be useful, yes? Let's do it. And let's just get rid of all the rest of the lays we have. We are in darkness. Now, let's equip that as a phone weapon. Oh, it doesn't work. Shucks. Uh, I was hoping that the glow sphere would give you the same effect if it was as your thrown weapon, but apparently it doesn't. Now we have. Now we can see. Okay. That would be pretty nice if you could, though. It'd be like having a uh, float sphere a little earlier. Not that it particularly particularly matters, but whatever. Whoa, Sigma jig. Okay. Usually you shouldn't go for those ten. Uh, inch strands. Is that feet, maybe? It's inches, feet, whatever. Who cares? I use the metric system. Uh, what the hell was I talking about? It wasn't fish. Oh my god, it's leeches! Oh, the W reminds me. I think before we saw segmented birthworms and I said they can dig. I was wrong! Uh, we're bleeding? It, oh yeah, we, because the leeches. Uh, there's this, an enemy that looks very similar to segmented earthworms and have a similar name. There's some earthworm thing or whatever. They are uh, what I was thinking of. Those can definitely dig. And you run into them much later on. Uh, whoa. 
So, what was I gonna say about something else? I feel like, I feel like I'm forgetting something. I'm always annoyed when Let's Players talk about something, and then they forget about it, and they never go back to it. Well, uh, apparently I'm one of those Let's Players that sucks. I mean, that says things that don't make sense. Oh no, he rusted that! I hate you. Well, now you got to see something rusted. If something's rusted, it says that. I'm not sure if rusted things can be broken down for bits. But I usually break down my grenades into bits anyways, which is why I tend to keep them instead of selling them. Even though I tend to get uh, a huge surplus of low quality bits, which these low quality Mark 1 grenades tend to be made out of. Uh, I did look at the camera, not the camera, the uh, clock. We'll start with the C. Uh, before this started, and I noticed, or not noticed, I calculated, jeez, what's wrong with me, uh, when to stop recording, and it seems to be that now is the time, so I should probably stop exploring and go end the recording. Bye-bye for now.